So besides the, the channels, you will also have the ability to, um, to change the settings of your radio. Um, let's go through the uh, in most important ones. So go to settings. Then we'll start with the basic settings. Um, let's see. I would leave all these just as they are. Um, this one here. Display mode for channel A, A and display mode for channel B. I put them both on name. Um, as you might have seen in the channels, um, I've named all the, the channels, which is easier because otherwise you have to remember the frequency. So um, I named all the channels, PMR01 and also LPD. And you can well, give it any name that you want, but um, the setting here shows what you want to see on your screen on your bow fan. You can choose either between um, the channel, so it's actually the row number, the name, which I just mentioned, or the actual frequency. Uh, my suggestion is to put them both on name because then you will see in your display PMR1, PMR2, and so on. And so on. Uh, the color of your display, it's all not that important. And here we have a pretty important one, or actually a pretty annoying one, the Roger beep. Please put this to off and uh, a lot of people will be very grateful if you do so. Advanced settings. Um, yeah, you have here the dual watch, which is enabled, which means that uh, the radio will listen on both channels. If you do not want that, then uh, disable it. Um, don't know why it's not clicking. Probably because I'm recording. Um, this you can all leave untouched. Other settings, yeah, you can create a welcome message. So if you power on your bow fin, it will, will show a message. I think it's limited to six or seven characters. I haven't really tested it. Um, for the rest, I will leave it alone. The work mode, uh, this is actually when you start your radio, what uh, will be the default. So uh, default channel A will be selected when you turn your radio on. Whether you want to turn your radio on in channel or frequency mode, I would suggest uh, channel because we named all the channels and that's fine. If you put it in frequency mode, you will have to manually enter the frequency yourself, which can be done, of course, but it's not preferable. Um, this one, if you would like to start your radio, for instance, on channel one, uh, on um, channel one for channel A and um, channel two for channel B, then you can select it here. It corresponds to the actual memory uh, uh, row in your left column here. Uh, leave this untouched. Blah, blah. So the rest, yeah, well, change them only if you know what you're doing. <laughs> 